Well done. Thank you. Thank you, Herr Kollege Stadler. Thank you, Mr. Stadler. For Kollegin Harms. Well, Mrs. Harms, if at the same one and the same time you want to s strike a blow against the Czech Republic because there is a case with Václav Klaus uh, being uh, taken to court, you know, then you've lost all credibility. <coughs> this is exactly the same as what you're talking about in Ukraine. I'd like to thank Mr. Fula talking about improving. Uh, relations between Ukraine and the EU. That's uh, down to your personal input, I think. I think this is definitely in our interest. We have to have an interest in making sure that the issues are much more uh, towards being pro-European. If it's going to be a, a, a Europe, Europe yes or no, we have to push towards yes. I mean, that's what the association agreement should be about. And the gas transit should be modernized in the interest of Europe as well. That's in our interest. We have to have an interest in making sure that what the Ukraine can do in 2013 to resolve the Transnistria conflict in the framework of being the president, a uh, rotating president of the OECD is something that has to be encouraged. Uh, we have to... Uh, keep up our endeavours and it is in the interest of Europe therefore to sign up to the association agreement and continue to press for our endeavours to improve the situation there. Protosievich. Mr. Protosievich. No, please. Yes, okay. it's, it's um, yeah. uh, Thank you, Chair. Commissioner. Today's debate is taking place two weeks after the EU-Ukrainian summit. The results of that summit are quite encouraging because the